we're in the middle of football and hockey season. We've had a bunch of our athletes come in with uh, concussion-related symptoms. And we wanted to post a video of our approach using the Buffalo concussion treadmill test. So I have Ben here on the treadmill. We've got a heart rate monitor hooked up to him. We've got the treadmill set at 3.6 miles per hour. We're going to gradually increase the incline to track his heart rate, ask him how hard it is using the uh, rating of perceived exertion, a scale of from 0 to 20, and we're going to ask him if his symptoms have changed as we increase the intensity. So every minute, we are going to increase the incline, and we're going to check in with Ben and ask how hard the exercise is. So how, how hard do you feel like you're working right now? It's light. Light. And you feel like your symptoms have changed at all since uh, helping you level up. So every minute we're going to check in and see if these symptoms have changed. Ultimately, we're trying to identify if there's any spikes in heart rate or any sudden change in his symptoms. And if there is, we can make that a threshold, a symptomatic threshold, and design a rehabilitation program using heart rate to cater to that threshold. So we would work underneath that threshold. This is the basic elements of the Buffalo concussion treadmill test that has been uh, put together by the University of Buffalo, Dr. Letty and colleagues.